Business is not easy, tapi it's really fun. Nama saya Farah Elina Azmi. Then I am the founder for Byton Classic. Saya based di Bangi, saya memang asal orang Bangi and kiranya berkecimpung dalam this business um, mainly because uh, nenek saya dulu memang uh, dia jual kek kukus buah. So dalam bidang ni saya buat full time sudah lima tahun tapi sebelum ni memang kiranya buat part time so sekarang uh, dah tahun kelima Byton dalam operation lah kiranya ok tutup dulu tu Esti ok ni saya tutup saya nak get ready hmm. untuk order masa awal-awal dulu banyak jual kat jiran-jiran kawan-kawan so starting from there kita ada a little bit more confident kiranya bila dah jual kat kawan tu kawan give feedback and then from there kita improve slowly and slowly and then um From there kita start to ada Instagram, social media kita lagi uh, kita kuatkan lagi social media and um, kita start letak dekat uh, kedai-kedai lain. Contohnya our best place yang kita dah letak is dekat KLCC lah. So that is the best place. That's how we grow quite big this year. Kebaran tu memang banyak. <laughs> so kita ada masalah um, pekerja, kita akan ada masalah cash flow, kita akan ada masalah Um, uh, supply barang, barang punya uh, procurement kita ada masalah dari segi uh, logistik macam kita nak hantar ke customer sebab uh, customer contohnya barang-barang kuih Melayu ni in general tak berapa mahal especially contohnya mi Bandung so harga harga mi Bandung tu sendiri hanya RM10 tapi delivery charge tu kalau orang let's say kat Gombak I mean they, they are not willing to pay sampai RM50 untuk delivery charge so Issues tu memang banyak kat setiap part of the business. Assalamualaikum. Ah, sorry muka kami belum moy. Kami nak review pasal Baitun. Um classic fruit cake. Ya Allah. Hey. Nak ni, nak ni sayang. Nak abang kat apa? Kek buah dia sedap gila. Oh. Nampak boleh pergi cari depa dekat sini. Ya. Sebenarnya uh, Mara ni uh, masa starting 2020 tu kiranya due to COVID uh, memang ada isu dari segi cash flow lah sebab uh, the demand was there tapi production pun kita orang ada isu production sebab barang tak ada sebab we use golden butter chain which is barang imported so they are not available in the market masa tu. So bila dah ada cash flow issue dari segi production tak boleh nak meet the demand and at the same time uh, supply pun drop. So I start to search for all the financing availabilities in the market. Kiranya um, because Muhyiddin our PM actually announced few packages. So from there I actually search one by one yang mana yang I can eligible to apply. Kiranya I actually also look into Tekun, I also look into PNB, PUNB, so macam kiranya I look into all the options available and from there, I actually do apply some of them, tapi yang get back to me only Mara je. So that's why I get to know Mara from there lah. So from Mara, I got um, Dana Nita uh, worth of RM30,000. First kali bila saya dapat the financing of RM30,000 tu, I invest into fixed asset yang macam industrial oven so industrial oven is not cheap so sebelum ni I guna oven yang kecil-kecil je macam tu but eventually memang terpaksa guna industrial oven so kita ada lebihkan productivity kiranya instead of satu hari boleh buat tiga je kita orang sekarang butter cake dah boleh buat sampai enam tu salah satu um, benda that I invested in also at the same time I invested in system kiranya sistem tu uh, I invest in Yaza punya sistem so dari sistem tu customer dah tak payah deal with us through whatsapp 
Sebab when the customer deal with us through WhatsApp Most of the time kita lose customer tu Sebab customer macam tunggu kita get back And then um, there's always a delay in us getting back So macam I need a system dari segi teknologi That can just okay daripada ordering ke payment um, The system has done it for us So the financing was also used to invest in system uh, At the same time I dapat uh, hire full time pekerja So sebelum ni I banyak ambil part time pekerja je sebab It's not strong enough. The cash flow tu tak strong enough. So sekarang ni, I invested in um, a full-time employee. So nak tak nak memang, Alhamdulillah lah because of the full-time pekerja tu, productivity memang triple. Business is not easy, tapi it's really fun. So kiranya macam, from day one to day 20, tak pernah ada satu hari yang sama. It's always going to be something new challenges, new new obstacles that you have to go through tapi if you like all these challenges memang I can assure you memang sangat berbaloi like all the 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 fruits memang come way way later tapi memang sangat berbaloi to to start a business I wish that Mara in the future will help more Udana Anita especially can help out those women yang lagi in need of financial sebab actually banyak business kat luar tu yang very very good it's just that most of the time they don't have the financing to grow Saya Farah Elina and saya founder kepada Byton Classic Terima kasih Mara